Air tags are one of the most convenient way to find out where is your car or pets, even your backpacks or anything you would like to trace with your iOS device. Sometimes you might face an issue that your air tags are not connected to your iPhone and it can be quite frustrating. In this video, I will show you how simple it is to actually reset your air tags in case if you are facing connection issues and also some of its hidden features and usage. To begin with, few key things to know here is that for your AirTags to work, there are some basic requirements. Your Find My iPhone should be turned on and Share My Location should also be turned on. Location services should be on, it's a must have. Also the Bluetooth should be turned on to pair the device. Now if you still face issues connecting your AirTags, just follow these simple steps to reset your AirTags and have a seamless connection afterwards. Press and hold your air tags with both hands and gently turn it anti-clockwise. Within seconds it will open. Now remove the battery and place it again. Do it for 4 to 5 times. I know it might sound silly but that's the way to do it. Just remove and place the battery 5 times. When you place it back you will hear a small chime which indicates that the battery is working and not dead. If there is no sound, then you might have to replace the battery first. So let's do it. 4 and 5. That's it. Now place the cover back again. Gently press and hold and this time rotate clockwise. Done. So the air tag is reset to its factory settings. Now you can easily connect any iPhone. In fact, after reset, it will automatically appear if you put any iPhone near to it for pairing just like this. If for some reason it doesn't show, then you can open Find My Application, go to Devices, click on the plus icon and choose the option Add Air Tag. Your iPhone will search for a nearby air tag and soon it will find it. Click on Connect. You can choose any name here. For example, I use it for my car a lot, so I will keep it as Car Air Tag. You can choose an emoji. Let's choose this sports car. Then click on continue. You will get a notification that AirTag is linked to your Apple ID. You must be signed on to your Apple ID. Click on agree. It will start the connection process. And once done, you will see this screen. Click on done. You can search for it in items. Tap on it. You can play sound or find it by search. You can play sound right from the search also. You also get two more options. Notification when found and lost mode. You can also rename it right from here. Also, if you don't want to use it and give it to someone else, you can remove it from your Apple ID right from here. One more cool thing about AirTags, very few people know is that if you find a lost AirTag, you can just place it behind your iPhone. As usually the NFC chip is at the left side of the iPhone, the upper side next to the cameras. When you place any AirTag there, it will take you to this web page on Safari It will show all the details about the AirTag, the serial number, owner's detail. You can reset it and disable it right from here. Well guys, that's all about AirTags. I really hope you liked this video. If you liked the video, kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. See you all soon in my next video. Till then, goodbye, peace and blessings.